hello guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be putting this revlon blow dryer that everyone on youtube and their mama has been talking about it so i'm going to put it to test let's see if it's worth the hype so the unique thing about this blow dryer is that it's is a brush it's a blow dryer but it's a brush as you can see so it has three settings it has the cool the low and the high so i got mine from walmart and i think it was less than 50 dollars or less than 60 dollars i can't really remember but it was not more than 60 dollars so my hair is damp because of course i just finished washing and deep conditioning it so i'm going to be starting with the low and then i will move on to the high later depending on how the low works on my hair my hair is fussy as you can see it's very coarse so the low might not really stretch out my hair the way i want it to but i'm going to start with the low and then go up to the high and um, because i'm even though i want to blow dry my hair i still don't want to put too much heat on my hair so yeah and also please let me say this i've said this before if you see me squeezing my face making any form of funny faces it's just because i'm very tender-headed i've said this before please ignore my face anything i do to my head hurts so that is why i'm squeezing my face i can't help it i i try not to even when i knew that i was recording but it just didn't happen so please ignore my face okay okay so right off the back i'm going to say that one thing i do not like about this blow dryer is the brush thingy i just don't like the fact that i have to keep going in with the brush and keep brushing my hair like a thousand times before my hair is blow dried i don't like that having to go in so many times i just don't like that maybe it's because my hair is fussy that is why because i feel like it's making the job really difficult for me having to go through my hair and keep brushing it like over and over again that is just the part that i really don't like about this this brush blow dryer thingy but if you have a different hair type like maybe 2a or 2b and you've tried this you might have a different experience altogether <laughs> If you have a fussy hair and you have tried this blow dryer, please comment below. Let me know how it worked for your hair, if you liked it or not, because I really don't think I like it for my fussy hair. Overall, it's not like a bad blow dryer. At least it gets the job done. And as you can see, my hair, it helps in stretching out my hair because like the constant brushing of the hair helps to like stretch out your hair, which is good. But I don't think I would really want to do this all the time because I want to stretch out my hair. There are other ways that I can do that without putting heat on my hair. On the beach. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So guys here is my hair all blown out it took me about an hour to do my entire head i had to divide of course you saw i divided my hair into four sessions but i went in again and further divided each session into two so that it would not take too long i hope you guys enjoyed watching this videos thank you so much for always coming by i really do appreciate please if you're not subscribed don't forget to subscribe please like this video share god bless you and i will see you in my next one bye bye Baby, that's ya, oh, yeah.